pleased to announce that the uh, New South Wales government has provided planning approval uh, for the upgrade of the three berths that are here behind me, berth 111, 112 and 113. This planning approval triggers a $182 million investment uh, in materials handling here at the berths in the future. This has uh, been a long time coming, but an important part of the evolution and development of the steelworks. It will mean that we can continue steel production as we go down the path of Blue Scope investing in the number six blast furnace. Uh, it will also give us opportunities to evolve steel making into the future. It's fantastic to be hosting the Minister here today. Uh, it shows a real commitment from the government to local manufacturing and the domestic steel industry in Australia. So the CLIP project is a very important project for Blue Scope. We've been here for nearly 100 years and our plan is to be here for the next 100 years and the CLIP project provides us with the capacity and the flexibility to meet those different demands as we transition to a lower emission steel making technology. The first stage of the project will be to move our coke loader down to the berth that we're standing on here right now. So that kicks off in January of, of uh, 24. Uh, the next stage of the project is the installation of a continual ship unloader on berth 111. So that will allow us um, some increased flexibility with the products that we're unloading. Um, it also provides additional capacity in the event we need to import um, volumes of coal or additional materials for lower emission steel making technology, for instance, larger volumes of scrap and potentially biochar into the future. I've long been an advocate of local steel and want to see more of our local steel in uh, projects, not only private sector projects, but also New South Wales government projects into the future.